Uh-oh, Jilly. What's Michael gotten us into now? Trouble, stay away from my door. Trouble, stay away from my door. Trouble, come back. Don't come around no more. Hey, folks, it's Mike and Angel with Retro RV Recon. Hi, good morning. We're coming to you today from Fairview Riverside State Park in Madisonville, Louisiana. And right behind us is the Chifuncta River. Some of the locals call it Chifuncti. We call it Chifuncta. Chifuncta River. We're yes. less than an hour away, so this is really a beautiful park that we've we've been to numerous times and we just wanted to show this one off. Yep, it's really pretty and it's really nice to have it right here by this beautiful river and the boardwalk. Oh man, just look at it. It's beautiful. It's, beautiful. it's really nice. Now, this part of the campground is only about half of what this state park offers, but we're gonna pivot or pan and show you the campground on, and how Let's close it is pan. to this Let's river. kind of slow here. Thank you. you. start to see the campground in the background. And you probably can see our retro somewhere you look, back there. Right over my head. Somewhere around there, over my head, is our camper. Mm -hmm. We loved it. We were in spot 66. Yes. We also have a view of the boat launch. Yeah, these are Louisiana State right. Park. And we review all of them, we comment on all of them, and we give this kind of information on all of them. Yes, we do the drive-throughs and the site walk around and share with you what we've done in the area on all of our stays whenever yes, we go camping. Yes. So not, look for those. Yeah, not just Louisiana, but not everyone. just Louisiana. Every place we stay, even on vacations. Especially vacations. We have one coming up to the Smokies. Nah, I love the Smokies. Okay, pants more. I'm sorry. I got, <laughs> I got wrapped up. And about. we're back to the river. Okay. Okay. Good. We'll see. Next up is the drive room. Here we go. All right, we're about to turn into Fairview Riverside State Park. entrance to this place. Fairview Riverside State Park. I like how they made the uh, the gate kind of like a shotgun house. Yeah, it does look like a shotgun house. It's very pretty. Very Louisianian. Yep. Okay, so the first, I'm going to start here, right? Yep. The odds are on the right, the evens are on the left. Okay, so 1 through 15. So where is this silver Number stream looking thing? That's one. We've got one to the right. Like the silver said. stream would be site two. Okay, site oh, two. Oh look, the numbers are right by the oh, oh, by yeah, the road. Right in view Perfect. Too. Excellent. So number three is you where think, the SUV is. I think we should favor a side with the camera. Oh, maybe not since these are close proximity. Yeah, and you can see the uh, stall. You can see the, the numbers on man, both that sides. Is nice. All right. Seven, eight. Yeah, the numbers six, are right. Seven, eight, nine. But it also means it's not very spacious. Right? Yes. Now these are only water and electric only. Yes. They do have tables at every site. And um, yeah, this is a. Oh, it, and at this particular time, we're heading. We're driving east. When we turned in facing the in, the uh, the check-in building that was looking north. Somebody suggested we point the um, direction. <clears throat> uh, we comment on the uh, the directions. So anyway, that's a one way. Yeah, let's, let's wait and come down at the other way so okay. we can show the numbers. A lot There's of people have cleared out today. Yep. Okay, one so way. this one you'll see 28 on the left and 29 yep. on the right. 29 is coming into view first. 
<clears throat> in the bathhouse straight ahead, you'll see that. Yep. And we are headed west now, right, baby? That's right. That tundra is on site 30, and we're driving west. Yeah, the roads aren't very <clears throat> wide either. No. I noticed the vehicles park in spots, and then it would be difficult to maneuver through here. Yeah, no, I know that. Bathhouses are very clean. They are well maintained. Well maintained, air conditioned. New. Site 34 right there. It looks like they lost a lot of trees <clears throat> during the last storm, too. Yep, Hurricane Ida did a lot of damage out this way. Lots of pine trees have been cut down to the stump. <clears throat> you see the playground across the way. And straight ahead past that parking lot is um, tent camping. Right. I think we should go right through that one again. The one yeah, I'm going to go through that um, that road we didn't get. Since this campground's not that big, it wouldn't hurt. And yeah, there's not that many people here no. now. See, so yeah, I think we'll be okay to do that. Back on this loop. 17 straight ahead. 16 is immediate left and the one next to it is the, 18 it should be the sites are not that deep and looks like most folks that have bigger rigs park their rig in the, the pad and park their tow vehicle somewhere else 19 to the right the white trucks in 22 and 23 yesterday angel and i saw our of uh, uh, a whitewater retro. Mm -hmm. That was the first time we've seen one out, which is it's a kind of a cousin to the one we have. Mm -hmm. It's like 27 on your right, 26 on your left. Oh, Michael, that's a graveyard. You don't want to cross the fence. We don't. I guess we don't. We need to be respectful. Yes, we do need there to There is a graveyard across the fence. And it looks like it's been there for a long it's time. It's old. Yeah, look at the trees down over. It doesn't look like it's being taken oh. care of. Oh, Sadly. <clears throat> do you need to look at this map? So this... The Silver Chevrolet is site 60. The Mallard? Yes. Mm -hmm. and see, that, these seem a lot more spacious than the inner loops, right? Yeah, they do. Turn, turn it back. 59 is a yeah. good spot. Right. Yeah. With some there, shade trees. You, if you guys can see, there used to be a lot more trees here, and the hurricane really did, did a number. Oh, I can't, I'm not supposed to go this way, but. It's the only way we can go. Right here are our um, sites. Um, let's see how I'm going to do this. I think that's 55 and then 54 and on, on the left side and on the right side is 56 and 53. There are two loops. They don't, they're not named, but um, as you, you just call it the front and the back loop. This is the front loop. And the back loop is where we stayed. Yeah, we stayed actually on the campground that's on the river. Yes. We'll take you back there in a second when we get done riding through this one. There's a nice playground to the right. You can't see it, but we'll show you that on the way out. Okay. Right here, we're going to have sites 40. Let's see, where's the sign at? Yeah, there it is. 40 on the right. There it 41 is. 41 on the left. So, I just can't get over how many stumps I'm looking at. They really lost a lot of pine trees they back did. here. This place had some campers in it this weekend, too. Oh, man. It was packed over <clears> here. <throat> Angel said this is... Um, Power and water only in the front section. Mm -hmm. 
It's limited on the back loop, but they do have sewer back there. Yeah, the back loop is a lot smaller, maybe half the size of this one. Mm -hmm. We did take the boat out for a little boat ride. We took brought our boat out here, and we did. We live within an hour's drive of here, so we were able to bring yeah. our boat over, and then. Um, go back and get our camper. Yep, that was fun. It was. It was nice <clears> having <throat> a boat right there at the boat launch by our, by our site. Yeah, we came out and uh, dropped off the boat on the trailer. Went back home, grabbed the camper. Mm -hmm. We even took a little boat ride from our campsite into Madisonville. That's right. We did a little shopping. We did a little shopping over in Madisonville. We went right under the Madisonville Bridge. We had some footage of that. And uh, Mike, like got in, Mike got into a little <laughs> trouble on that boat ride, but I'll let y'all see the video and you can decide for yourself whether he was in the wrong. Yeah, I can now <laughs> say that I have been pulled over by the police on a river. The sheriff's department. Yep. St. Tammany Sheriff's, yeah. You go about it fast in that little bad dude boy. <laughs> if they knew how big our motor was, maybe it would be laughable for everyone. It's a four horsepower <laughs> on a, a flat of. <laughs> 14 foot flat boat. Look yeah. at this view. Look yeah. at this view. Look, Look at, at this view. Now, this is the Chifuncta River that you see as we're pulling into the back section of the campground. And it's just beautiful. <clears throat> that pier runs. Boardwalk. I'm sorry, the boardwalk runs along the length of the uh, this back loop. But at this particular time, it's barricaded off because of the hurricane. Yeah, it's going to need some repairs. So they yeah. just they just ripped it off. They don't want you to get on there. Yeah. So um, start coming into the view is the bathhouse for this back loop. It's on the right, the yellow yeah. building. And you can see there's plenty of parking. You can park and go walking around out here. Look at those beautiful trees, shade trees with the Spanish moss. has a laundry room in here. The, the bathrooms mm -hmm. are clean. They are really clean. nice. It's new stuff. It's not anything old. Mm -mm. It's all the, the laundry mm -hmm. room, everything's clean there. The laundry room is small. There's one machine, one washer, yeah. one dryer, but um, it's really nice. <clears throat> you got your fish cleaning station over there in the yeah. corner. And that's the river. We uh, we went boating in this river right here. Mm -hmm. Just a little boat out. I'll show you some footage of the campground yeah. from the river.
there's the Swamp Trail. That's a real nice little walk. It's a wheelchair accessible. You can go the whole loop on a wheelchair if you wanted, if you needed to. It's not a long trail at all. No, it comes out by quarter, the boat launch. Yeah, about a quarter mile. We'll show you that in a little bit, but it's a pretty walk through the swamp. Jilly loved it. Drive on the outside loop, the outside loop of this back loop. Let's just call it the river loop. Yeah, this is the to river me loop. the river section of the So the around. outside loop on the river loop, it's just water. It's uh, 20, 30, and 50 amp in water. The inside loop of the uh, of the river loop has all hookups. Well, I'll tell you exactly which ones because they're easy to name. There's only a few of them. There's only six sites that have water, sewer, and electric. So the sewer sites back here would be... That Ram 25. Oh, it's a 1500. Oh, he fooled me because Michael, he had the jack Michael. Up. Go ahead. The sites with <laughs> sewer, 71, 73, 75... 77, 79, 81. So we'll show you that loop in just a second. But look at this boat launch. Here's the boat launch. People come back here fishing. Mm -hmm. And like Michael said, we dropped our boat, went home and got our camper, and then we were able to use the boat whenever we felt like it. Go out on the river exploring. Cruise on into Madisonville. Mm -hmm. Grab us a snack a or a couple ride. of groceries. Come on back. It was kind of cool. I felt like a local. Yeah. It was real convenient. Yep. There's plenty of space to put your boat trailer back here. And yeah, the sites are the the sites themselves. They're still kind of short definitely manageable. Mm -hmm. I mean, you can see that this imaging, I mean, this imagined camper. You, you didn't point out our restaurant. Oh, I'm going to we'll point it out. We'll make that other loop. All right. We, we met, we met several folks uh, out here on this camping trip. Real nice folks. We did. It was just such a beautiful weekend. Everyone was real friendly. I mean, they usually are anyway, so. Oh, shoot. Yeah, the highs in, um, the high temperature was in the, the, the mid- Fifth demand 60s. Mm -hmm. Look at that beautiful river. Yeah, yeah. We walked out here several times this weekend. And if you hear the heavy breathing, that's Jilly in the back. That's not me. She's so excited to be looking out the window. <laughs> yep. So we're going to go down <clears> the <throat> inner loop. Now we're going to go down the inner yeah. loop. And these are the ones you'll see with the sewer connections. So we had. 76. 75. It starts off at 76. You can't see it right now, but, um, oh, I'm sorry. You're talking about the sewer. 76 is not sewer, baby. I'm sorry. Right, do you have it pointed to the right? I do now. These over here are the sewer site, starting with 75. And that's a wheelchair accessible, accessible. So we have 75, 73, and 71 are sewer sites. And then on the other side, um, of them, 77, 79, and 81 have sewer hookups. We did not. So nope. when you see Michael do the site walk around, um, we have water and electric only. Yep. As do all the other sites here. We include a map at the beginning of each video so that you can see um, on the map which ones are full hookups. There it is. Woohoo. <laughs> there we are. And that's site 66? Yep. So what else did we do, Michael? The Otis house is here. Yeah, that's right. We did walk around Otis house. We have a little really bit cool. of footage of the Otis yeah. house and some more beautiful live oak trees on that property. <laughs>
they are doing some repairs to the roof over there and to the picket fence, but it's a beautiful area over there. We saw the steam engine. Yes, we did. They have over there, they preserve. Preserve from the timber industry that used to be all in this area. Yep, let me cut by this river one last time. On FYI, there's a, a, a dump station on the front loop, and there's a dump station right here for this back mm -hmm. loop. So there's two two separate dump stations. Yeah. But look at this beautiful river. We had so much fun out there, didn't we, Michael? We did. We rode. We rode. I guess we we traveled for maybe a couple of miles on mm -hmm. the river. We did just to enjoy it. And it wasn't busy. Right? Uh, we we passed a few boats here and there every now and then. a wooden boat festival every year and that's a really big event and so um, lots of boating here. Oh right there's a handicap um, pad handicap accessible. Yeah these two. Yeah they're, they're in handicap accessible. Yeah they're in we're starting by the river so that would be 75 and 77. 75 and 77 are wheelchair yes. accessible. And they're close to the bathhouse and close to the uh, water. So, Michael, which spot would be our favorite if we were going to reserve again? Which one do you think we would pick? 76. 76. 76, uh, the awnings are facing the, um, the water. Yes, the right over there yeah, on, the, right. on the corner. It's not a sewer site, but it's, it's a beautiful site. It's a beautiful view yeah. of the river. We had a nice view of the boat launch. And we had a nice, big, spacious site. And you'll yeah. see that in the site walk around. And if we didn't have site 76, I think 66 is, is my second favorite. Mm -hmm. Only because, I mean, you're okay. it's Very pretty you under the out. trees. You're about to see it in the site walk around anyway. Mm -hmm. So stay tuned for that. All right, see you in a second. Here we go. All right, folks, here we go. We got the site walk around. This is site 66. You can see off in the distance, there's the boat launch. We did bring our boat out here, our little 14-foot uh, flat boat, de boat. And that camper with the white truck, that's our neighbor. They just pulled in. Give you an idea how far away that camper is. The um, back to front, this pad is a little bit out of level, no big deal. Side to side, it's pretty good. You see we have a fire pit. A lot of acorns to crunch when you walk. A grill. Very nice shady spot. Some of these beautiful oak trees. Oh, actually, with the trees are always pretty, but the, uh, this, site, this um, Spanish moss is really cool. But anyway. This is a corner. 66 is a corner site. So you get a lot of extra room. Jilly likes it. You can see here, that's where our neighbor was yesterday. It's pretty close, maybe 10 feet away. And of course, you have your hookups back here. The site does not have sewer. This outer loop does not have sewer, but the inner loop, the, the yeah, I guess the inner loop does. 20, 30, 50 amp water hookup. You've seen one, you've seen them all. But here you go.
guess the driveway is about I guess driveway is about 80 feet long no not 80 50 maybe so Angel and I do these reviews the drive throughs and the site walk around for every campground we visit and if you find this helpful please subscribe because we have more to come we're gonna share more as we go not just Louisiana and Mississippi but every place we go all right folks happy trails and happy camping Riverside State Park in Madisonville Louisiana it's a fun ride. Uh, we're not exactly in the park right now. Angel, oh, can you tell them where no. we are? We are on the Chapuncta River. If you've ever seen... All in the name of entertainment. We're not in the campground at the moment. No, we're not. Down in there, including enjoying our boat on this very river. Right, Michael? This very river. And yeah. if, you, if you pay attention to the signs, because there's a speed limit. <laughs> There's a speed limit. You will get pulled over they by They do sheriff police deputy. this river. So you, I have footage. So stay tuned for that. Okay, you ready? I'm a thug. Ready? Yes. Here we go around in circles. Get a fly high like a bird up in the sky. I've got a boat that ain't got no motor. It does have a motor. Don't take me down to a river. <laughs> yes. So we're going to do the... Let you talk now. I was gonna say right behind us is one of the the bathhouse. Give me. Bet they got some alligator up in there. <laughs> no doubt, right? Okay, let's I do can't another. Find my traps. Let's. <laughs> you have traps everywhere. Ooh. Hold on, the boat just hit the bank. Back in the boat, came back yeah. over. Don't speed <laughs> in this river. <laughs> Do y'all mind being on video? Look really mean like he's getting a takeout. Yeah, we have a YouTube channel. Jean Baptiste Douay. Right. When he crossed the Atlantic. Jean. Jean. Okay. Yeah, Jean. Jean, Jean Baptiste, Baptiste Douay, right? Okay. Told his boy, Le Jean. Le Jean? Le Jean Jr. <laughs> there was a Le Jean Jr. Of course. He said, Is it fun when you go down in Louisiana? I want you to start a fire out there by the body. Alright. And then when you sit down and you got your shoes off and you put them your clothes on side the fire, look over at your wife and go, no.